மணியம் இன்ஸ்டிடியூட் ஆப் சயின்ஸ் அண்ட் டெக்னாலஜி தஞ்சாவூர் ஆஃபர்ஸ் பி ஆக் ரேங்க்ட் நம்பர் டுவெண்டி டூ இன் இந்தியா பை ஐ ஐ ஆர் எஸ் ஐ திங்க் இட்ஸ் வெரி குட் லா தட் நீட்ஸ் டு பி டன் நவ டேஸ் லாட் ஆஃப் கவர்மெண்ட்ஸ் ஆர் இன்டர்ஃபியரிங் வித் ஒர்க் ஆஃப் கவர்மெண்ட்ஸ் அண்ட் ஐ டோன்ட் திங்க் இட்ஸ் ஃபேர் ஜென்ரல் கவர்மெண்ட் கவர்னர்ஸ் அண்ட் ஆஸ் வெல் அஸ் அதர் ஸ்டெப் ஷுட் நாட் கிவ் எனி பர்சாலிட்டி வித் அதர் திங்ஸ் சி ஐ திங்க் இட் டிபெண்ட்ஸ் ஆன் த ரூலிங் பார்ட்டி இன் ஜென்ரல் ஸோ கரண்ட்லி வி நோ பிஜேபி இஸ் த ஒன் ரூலிங் த பார்ட்டி அண்ட் தீ ஸ்டேட்ஸ் அட் யூ மென்ஷன் டோன்ட் நெசசரிலி ஹாவ் அ சீஃப் மினிஸ்டர் ஃப்ரம் த ரூலிங் பார்ட்டி ஸோ இட்ஸ் வெரி இம்பார்ட்டன் தட் யூனோ there is no any undue influence on the governors across the state to ensure uh, first of all i want to congratulate my rls uh, i appreciate our cm for initiating this uh, this one anyway i request my governor to clear as it is <laughs> Uh, in Tamil Nadu, the Chief Minister M.K. Stalin uh, continuously condemns the act of the uh, governor for, no, uh, for delaying uh, to answer the bills uh, on time. So, likewise, recently, uh, Delhi CM uh, Aravind Kejwal has also stated that there should be a stipulated time period for uh, governors so that they can apt, uh, act on the bills and they can reply uh, uh, sooner so that the, it, it didn't get uh, delayed. So, uh, here, Tamil Nadu government has started something which is now uh, spreading in other states too. What's your opinion on this? as far uh, as i am concerned uh, this is a good move uh, there should be a time limit for uh, uh, signing a proposal given by the state government i think it's a very good law that needs to be done uh, nowadays a uh, lot of governors are interfering with the work of uh, governments and i don't think it's fair for they have been elected they have been voted and they will uh, win the seats but having these governors interfering with their work is not not uh, not that ethical or not not that been done before uh, before governments i feel like that general government uh, uh, governors and as well as other staff should not give any partiality with uh, the things because the state government the people have been elected by the directly by the, by the public so that uh, this should be restricted and uh, Uh, these things may not be uh, extended or unwanted uh, delays anyway i request my governor to clear as it is <laughs> see i think uh, it depends on the ruling party in general so currently we know bjp is the one ruling the party and uh, these states that you mentioned don't necessarily have a, a chief minister from the ruling party so it's pretty important that you know there is no any undue influence on the governors across the state to ensure uh, we have an unbiased uh, you know Uh, thought process when it comes to you know laying out the constitution and also ensuring they do the necessary steps to pass any specific bills in general uh, i i feel that uh, in over the last uh, you know few months we are seeing so much of you know uh, you know negativity on the opposition party or uh, or on the uh, any state that is not governed by the you know uh, the main uh, primary party so it's important that you know uh, we have a constitution that actually works on democracy democracy per se so we should have both ruling party and opposition party having their own say and it should be uh, in such a way that i feel it's important that we feel uh, you know uh, they have a say in what they do and also if it's the right thing to do they have to do the right thing so if it's passed by the parliament if it's passed by the respective state uh, uh, legislation it's important that they pass that bill if it's uh, in their control so uh, i would say this is my uh, very general uh, statement it's important that you know uh, elected party elected members act responsibly and ensure you know uh, the tax payers money is not wasted in parliament and ensure you know uh, uh, they they don't necessarily you know uh, waste the time and resource and effort of everyone not just the government media and everyone else right we we are they are the voice for us and they have to ensure that they you know uh, uh, they uh, they do their necessary things when it comes to doing the day to day job so uh first of all i want to congratulations my rls i appreciate our cm for initiating this uh, this one because uh, anyhow someone is going to oppose our governor and the initiation is uh, initiated by our government is uh, i feel that's that's a great one and apart from this uh, our cm is the one who is elected by our people and governor is the one uh, who is elected, uh, proposed by our government central government people so the, the who is who is not eligible for uh, uh ordering or some other things doing in the particular government or particular state or some other thing i feel more uh, happy when because that particular initiation of opposing the governor uh, 
by, for not introducing or not de by delaying these uh, bills or some other things which are produced by our government and opposing that particular uh, requirement which is uh, kept which is a uh, good thing for our people is doing by our government is somewhat uh, great I feel. The initiative is something which is taken by the Tamil Nadu government. Now it can be seen in, uh, it, it is being spread in other states too. What's your opinion on this? I mean, yeah, before that I have never heard the news like this. Governors are interfering with government's uh, deals and uh, bills. Nowadays I'm hearing from a lot of states like that. And it's kind of new to uh, hear. And I think governors' uh, responsibility is to take care of the ruling uh, parties and uh, opposition parties. But they don't have any rights to take over the bills and uh, responsibilities of a government. I feel like that. My opinion is it should be banned in each and every state because... It actually it's not a game. It's really a, it's really a, that uh, I'm also a victim. Actually, I tried uh, a lot of games in there. I have lost so much money in there because it's not really a game. It's really a, they are using us. They are using us to get money. That's all. Where are money my Institute of Science and Technology, Tanjavur? Offers B York ranked number 22 in India by IIRF.